Bringing home the math, a program for parents and preschoolers. Lesson three, shape. This. A circle, a green circle. When preschoolers begin learning about circles, triangles, rectangles, and squares, you may not realize they're doing math, but learning about shapes and what defines them are foundations for later understanding of more complex geometry. How do you know it's a triangle? Because it has three sides. And how many corners? Three. Today, in part three of NJN's six-part series, Bringing Home the Math, we'll take a look at shape. We'll show you how three, four, and five-year-olds are going way beyond the basics, and how you can support your child's learning by playing some fun math games at home. Three, four. Uh, you win. <laughs> We visited Bradley Elementary School in Asbury Park and Edmund Himaleski Junior Early Childhood Center in Perth Amboy and found young children love identifying shapes. Cir circle. Circle, that's right. But these days, preschoolers aren't just naming shapes, they're learning the shape's properties. This one. What size does a triangle have? One, two, three, three, four. Let's try again. One, One two, two, three. A triangle has three sides. Teaching children the attributes of shapes is key to helping them truly differentiate one shape from another. Help them understand why it's a triangle. It's a triangle because it's got three sides and three corners. And once they've grasped the concept that that's why it's a triangle, then they can generalize it to other triangles and understand those are triangles. So the math is really understanding what are the attributes that make it that shape. It can help them in the same way as learning any early math. You're, you're teaching them not just names, but how to think about it. And the thinking here involves analyzing parts of it and then doing the comparison. In this preschool classroom, students go on a treasure hunt to find various shapes. Be sure to take three steps forward and find all the squares in the water table. Along the way, they discover some impressive vocabulary. What shape did you find? An octagon. An octagon. Very good. This is eight sides. A stop sign is eight sides. So let's count so that we can see the yeah, difference between an shape. octagon and a hexagon. These are hands-on, fun Seven, lessons parents eight. can and should replicate an at home. I think the homeschool connection is very important in fostering children's success through school. But also, I think the reason why these children can acquire these skills that are surprising to some people that preschoolers would know what a hexagon is, is because I've you know, made it so meaningful and so real to them. It's just it's part of their everyday existence in this classroom. So when you make that connection at home, that only strengthens their knowledge base even more. To help parents teach their young children about shapes and their attributes, math education consultant Barbrina Ertl has designed some activities that can be downloaded from NJN's website, including this game called the Shape Race. How many sides? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's how many spaces you move, six spaces. With using the dice with the shapes on it, the children are being asked to analyze the shapes and realize what it is that defines them as that shape. It focuses them on those defining attributes. It was fun. Um, it was a great idea with the shapes for him to actually see the word and the shape to count the sides so he'll get you know the reading and the counting as well as playing. When it comes to talking about shape with your child, you can trace around the sides and point out what makes each shape unique. A circle has one round side but no straight sides. 
A triangle has three straight sides and three corners. Once they have that concept down, you can show them other kinds of triangles, like obtuse and acute. Since they all have all the attributes, they're still triangles, no matter how you look at them. A rectangle has four straight sides and four right-angle corners. A square is a special kind of rectangle where all the sides are of equal length. Here's a triangle. Oh, Denise, you found a triangle. Ah. Wherever you are, you can have fun reviewing shapes with your child to help him get excited about grasping geometry down the road. Oh, I see pride and I see a passion for learning, which, which you know, is being cultured and developing, you know, that they, they will pack it in their suitcase and take it with them to the higher grades. Browse NJN's Bringing Home the Math website to find activities, literature lists, and other resources about how to help your young child learn more about shape. Funding for NJN's Bringing Home the Math program for parents and preschoolers has been provided by Bank of America.